You know, early on in, in concepting out the designs that are going to make Ashes of Creation, I had a lot of fun particularly with, with thinking about the caravan system in general because it involves that risk versus reward that I and so many others like me enjoy, you know, getting to fight for what you've worked hard to earn. Uh, and getting to keep that reward at the end of the day when you're successful, uh, or the bite that happens if you lose it. It's, 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 a fun, it's a fun experience in a game where you don't know what the outcome is going to be, but you have to participate uh, in order to achieve these things. So the caravan system really allows players to kind of be cooperative, to be against one another. It's really up to the friends and foes that you make during your experience as a player. The mayor system is the primary way that citizens interact with their node. Um, by choosing a mayor, uh, the citizens kind of give the power to the mayor to drive the big decisions that the node faces. Um, this includes things like the economy. It includes things like alliances and trade routes. And so the mayor uh, basically chooses the direction that the node goes. Does the node want to be economically focused? Does it want to be more warlike? Uh, the uh, the node's mayor determines which direction it goes, and so the citizens kind of put faith into their mayor. There are a lot of tools that are available to the mayor. Uh, they can dictate the course of a node's development by electing certain buildings to be built. Uh, they can determine alliances and trade agreements between their fellow cities around them. Um, they can declare wars and they can initiate these caravans as a means to transit goods between the different regions. Uh, mayors have a lot of control over that, which is why monthly players have the ability to change the mayor out if they don't like the direction that their city is going. The caravan system is another very big part of the node system. Uh, the, they are the main driver of economic activity, and there's a bunch of different types of caravans. The one that we're talking about today is the mayoral caravan. The mayoral caravan is what's launched when mayors are trying to establish a trade route with another node, or they may be trying to garner extra resources by doing a caravan quest. Developing a city is no small process. Uh, it requires a lot of resources and the aid of a lot of different players. Uh, the caravan system is a way for players to participate uh, in driving that trade between the different cities that exist in the world to ensure that your node has the resources it needs to continue development. We really wanted players to experience that risk versus reward. You know, in, in the times that I've played MMORPGs over the past decade or so, you know, I've noticed that that's slowly been creeping out of the calculus for player interactions in the game. Risk versus reward, it's all just become reward for the most part. Um, and the caravan system really allows the player to take a risk and in exchange, depending on the size of that risk, they get an equitable reward. The caravan system allows for that to exist by moving goods that can be lost during that transit. Uh, it becomes a very dangerous activity, one that requires the support of a lot of your friends or guilds or fellow citizens to make sure that those goods make it to their destination. There's really so much that goes into creating Ashes of Creation. It is by far probably the most ambitious uh, project that I've ever seen, both as a player and now as being a part of the development process. There's really so many moving pieces. And for a design team and, and our designers like Jeff and Akil uh, and Terrence and the other designers that we have, you know, bringing all of these pieces together is quite a feat. And it's really cool to see when one of them comes online. And, you know, as our players get to see more of these videos and get to see these different systems coming online at different stages and eventually get to experience them in the different alphas, it's, it's really gonna be a fulfilling and satisfying event to actually get that experience on video, see them playing it on Twitch. You know, watching the players experience all of these different systems is gonna be, is gonna be quite a satisfying thing. Completing these systems, getting them ready and functional, is a huge deal to the Ashes of Creation project as a whole. Um, we've kind of nailed down the, the basic node system, but the mayor system and the caravan system are kind of the action-based part of the node system. They're what make the nodes an actual living, breathing thing that has choices involved, and those choices have consequences. Um, and those consequences are really what's important to making these nodes feel alive. So the mayoral system and the caravan system are kind of the two big things that once they're in place, we have a node system. 
And that's great because that means we are at a milestone where we're getting ready for that next phase of testing.